All right, this is us. Uh, Hello. All right, this is a bit socket, and me and Scott oh. are up to a special preview event for the 3DS, which um, everyone is going to. Yeah, as well. um, everyone in Glasgow. We can't actually film inside, so we're doing a wee bit of secret filming right now. Yep. So um, it's probably going to be um, a really long session on Nintendo Dogs <laughs> and Deep Fighter with the submarines. We'll tell you what it's like after. Bye bye. <laughs> Okay, so now Scott's playing. Uh, had a wee shot at Dinner Alive Dimensions. It was actually quite nice of Team Ninja to take their volleyball series and take the gills for it from it and uh, put them into a fighting game for once. It was I quite enjoyed playing that for a change. Although I found it odd that they weren't wearing bikinis, they were actually wearing like ninja garb, etc. etc. As a as a first fighting game it's actually quite impressive. <laughs> the TD added a lot to the experience actually, but, um, even though it, ha it cut the frame rate in half. A lot of purists will say that's going to ruin the game for them, but for me it actually made it even better because it did actually look nicer. But that's just my opinion, isn't it? So, fuck me. You can keep your dinner alive dimensions because I was playing the daddy. I was playing Super Street Fighter 4, 3D, 3DS or 3D, whatever it's called. And it's brilliant, it's great. I mean, I can actually pull off special moves in it just because all you need to do is tap the bottom screen. Maybe it'll be a bit too easy to play. Uh, competitively, I'm not sure, but I mean, I have to admit, it looks brilliant. It's better than the iPhone version, not as good as the PlayStation 3 version, obviously, but it plays well, nice frame rate, and I can still beat your ass at it. And here it is, Ridge Racer 3D, the game Joe has been waiting for his entire... Th this last year, just been waiting for this for last year. Um, and it's smashing, it looks brilliant, it's maybe not as good looking as the one in the PSP, but the 3D really does help in it, in that it gave me a bit of a sore head, but I still won. I still won, that's the important thing, I still won. I'm like Rocky, in Rocky 2. Not Rocky 1, where he lost. Rocky 2, where he won. And then uh, the last game that me and Scott played a wee shot of was Kid Icarus. Now, I think this game, that's a game of two halves, literally. Um, the, when you're flying about, the half of the game when you're flying about, uh, like Lilac was into the screen, shooting baddies, is really, really impressive. And the, uh, the 3D in it means that you get a really good sense of scale, and when the bullets come towards you, you know when to dodge them and stuff like that. But when you're on foot, the controls don't quite work properly. I found the kind of running about to be a bit awkward. The camera was well, pointing the wrong direction. I was always shooting the floor, shooting my feet, shooting the guy's nose. He's not really, you know, wasn't really playing it properly, but flying about was great fun. I agree. I think the in the air stuff makes me think that maybe getting a Japanese 3DS will be worth it because there'll be a lot of shmups coming out for this baby. You're talking about a lot of great games are going to come out because it works as a shmup and it'll be great to play a shooting game in 3D. On the ground it plays like a pretty substandard third person shooter. It's, the controls aren't made for it. But it's just a demo. It could get better but I agree with Joe. I think playing it in the 3D, shooting about in the skies, it looks amazing. And maybe it actually was one of the games that stood out for me as the best looking game. Bark like a dog! So when's it the 26th of March? Something like that. Are you, are you gonna are you gonna buy one? Probably, but I'm gonna get an American one because it's cheaper. Oh yeah. <laughs> well that's um, a wee bit socket Sunday special for <laughs> that's you. That's a bit socket top tip there. Buy an American one, because I'm probably not gonna bring the good games out in Europe. USA! <laughs> USA. <laughs> See you later. Bye bye. <laughs>